Today we will learn how to replace the content on the screen of this laptop with a video. Let me start by loading a video that I want to replace with. The video cannot directly be placed on top of the screen because the screen is not rectangular. So we need to apply a perspective transform on the video layer. And to add effects, let me double tap on the segment to bring up the effects editor. But before we apply the perspective transform, let me cut the corners of the video in a rounded shape. Without the sharp edges, the video would blend better into the background. And for rounded corners, let me add the rectangular mask effect from the masking category. And then edit the properties of the rectangular mask. First make the mask fit inside the video layer, just leaving a small boundary. And then, increase the corner radius, which is zero initially. And finally, invert the mask. So that the inside of the rectangle is visible, but the outside becomes transparent. Okay, now we have these nice and rounded corners for the video layer. And now we are going to add the most important effect, the perspective transform. Which can be found under the transform category. And when we open the settings for this effect, we can see these four control points on the screen. Perspective of the layer can be adjusted using these control points. When we tap and drag these points, they do not move immediately. This is to leave a gap between the fingertip and the control point so that we can see where the control point is moving. Let me try to fit the video perfectly into the screen of the laptop. I think this looks fine. Let me go back and play the video. But before that, I need to adjust the length of the image layer to fit into the length of the video. It's all done now. Let's play and see how it looks. Doesn't it look like the video is playing on the screen of the laptop? Perspective effect can be applied. Whenever you are trying to superimpose a video on a layer that has a distorted surface due to its perspective. Thank you for watching.